In addition to using robots for repetitive data migration tasks, UiPath can also support large-scale one-time migration and system configuration by coordinating migration tasks handled by technology alliance partners like Sirius IQ, who are specifically focused on such migrations. In this case, we will focus on the exchange on-premise to exchange online migration, a complex migration exercise moving massive amounts of data, typically hundreds of terabytes. In scenarios like this, there are many manual steps that can easily and quickly be handled by unattended robots, instead of waiting for human validation. These robots can run 24-7 in off-business hours when these large-scale migrations typically take place. The example process demonstrates a few of these processes including monitoring, error handling, and validation. Once a human has triggered the migration using Orchestrator to manage the robots, UiPath and Sirius IQ are also involved on large-scale SAP migrations where robots are used not just to coordinate migration exceptions, but also to validate migrated transactions. Examples of this are customers such as Devon Energy. Here, we focused on exchange for brevity since the SAP scenario is much more complex. We've already walked through how the RPA developer experience works, so I'll quickly show you how this particular process is structured. In this scenario, robots perform one or more tasks such as check to see if an exchange data container has finished migrating, retry errors in the completed container, or validate that the migration has completed successfully. To monitor the status of the container's migration, the robot will log into Sirius IQ just as a human would and navigate to the appropriate workflow. UiPath is also able to integrate with Sirius IQ via the REST API. It navigates to the appropriate workflow, which populates the list of containers and their progress. The robot loops through the list and captures the names of those that are completed. These are added to a queue in Orchestrator. Queues store transactions and make it easy to manage those transactions across one or multiple robots, critical in very large-scale parallel migration scenarios. The next step is to retry errors in the completed containers. The robot retrieves the container names from the queue we populated in the last example. For each of these containers, the robot will retry the errors. The queue keeps track of the state of each of these transactions, how long they took the process, and any errors that may have occurred. Once each of the queue items have been completed by the robot, the robot can perform the final validation check. In this case, it will scan both the source and target email inboxes to ensure that the migration was completed successfully. It will compare the total number of emails in each inbox and can loop through each of the messages to ensure that their contents are the same. Now that I've tested my entire process, I can deploy it to Orchestrator. Orchestrator is the centralized management environment where companies can manage their robots, processes, queues, and more. The Robot tab enables management of each robot and its state. The Processes tab enables you to control which processes, built in Studio, are deployed into production with the version control built in. The Schedules tab enables you to specify when your robots are running which tasks. In this case, you can have the robots running constantly in parallel with the migration. Once the migration is over, the robots are free to do other work. Finally, the Queues tab 
enables you to view each of the transactions that the robots are performing, along with information such as their status, start time, end time, and any exceptions that may have occurred. In summary, this scenario showed how UiPath robot processing is being applied to handle the coordination and management of large-scale migration process rather than actually doing the migration as you saw earlier in the demo.